I brought about 150 old documents that date for as early as 1775, and most of them go up to maybe 1860, a few later, and also a collection of postcards. I collected postcards fairly seriously starting around the year 2000 and sort of gave up maybe two years ago because at my age I have too much stuff. So I just quit. <laughs> Uh, the documents, most of the documents I bought at uh, an auction probably 15 years ago. Uh, there was an antiquarian by the name of Charles Straub who lived in Troxelville. And uh, Hassinger and Courtney had a two-day sale of his material. Uh, there were, it consisted mostly of documents and books. This is a very interesting postcard. Um, this shows the aqueduct that transported the Pennsylvania Canal across Penn's Creek at the south end of the Isle of Kew. Uh, this is a photograph of the Middle Creek Power Dam, uh, which is south of Sealands Grove. Those are some of the interesting postcards. Um, are a lot of them written on? Pardon me? Are a lot of them written on? Uh, yes. Uh, a lot of them were sent, but I also have a lot that, you know, were, were never sent. These three documents, the bottom one's written in German, are receipts from uh, the several children of Adam Bolander who had moved to the area of Uniontown, Ohio. And there, they were children when their grandfather, who was named Philip Moore, died. And uh, they had to wait until they reached the age of 18 before they could collect their inheritances. And, these are the receipts that they gave to the executors of the estate. And this entire book here is filled with about 50 old documents that are in German. I haven't translated, haven't even tried to translate most of them. I've translated a, a few of the smaller documents that were written in German. Uh, but there's some long documents in there. There are court records and summonses for people to go to court and that sort of thing.